What's going on, moviegoers? If you're new to the channel, my name is Christian. Welcome to Sea World Productions. You guys, Doctor Strange in the Vulture for some madness. You guys, tickets have officially dropped online this morning. I hope you guys were able to snag your tickets. I know that the AMC app is struggling right now. As usual, just like with Spider-Man No Way Home, it took me about four to five hours to snag my tickets for that damn movie. I was so lucky. This morning, I didn't even set my alarm clock. I just randomly woke up, went on the app, snagged my two seats, and it was done. I didn't have to wait in line, nothing like that. Blessings upon blessings, you guys. But I'm excited. They dropped a 60-second TV spot for Doctor Strange and Multiverse of Madness, you guys. We are just about a month over under watching this movie, and I cannot express how much I am excited for this movie. This movie is going to be a huge game changer. And I think it's going to be, honestly, if I'm honestly speaking, this is a trilogy of the multiverse. I think this is where it ends. Because I don't think Kevin Feige and Marvel Studios want to continue on this whole thing of the multiverse. It's going to get very complex and very yeah. weird. Now, granted, I'm not saying I wouldn't want that. That would be dope. But I feel like with WandaVision, Loki, not even a trilogy. Because, you know, you throw WandaVision in there. Because I feel like that was the start of it. And you have Loki, and then you have Spider-Man No Way Home, and then you have Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. So I do think that they'll wrap up the multiverse story mainly within this film. But I'm excited, you guys. Let's check out this TV spot for Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness. The hype is real. I cannot wait. All right, you guys ready? One, two, three. Oh, Illuminati! What? Oh man. <laughs> oh shit. Away go. We got to see Wanda's kids. We got to see them. She's talking about a nightmare that she experiences every night. Now, I don't know if that's because of the dark hold or this is some kind of variant of Wanda and that she just can't get to her kids, but I cannot wait to see the growth spurt of Wiccan and Speed, you guys. They are going to be part of the new Avengers moving forward. There's no way you tease them as kids and not do anything with them by the end of this movie. I guarantee you we will see Wiccan and Speed and, you know, their full growth headed into the MCU going into the Young Avengers. Let's talk about evil Doctor Strange, zombie Doctor Strange with the third eye. Yeah, I love the fact that we're getting so many different variants of Doctor Strange. It is so dope. I cannot wait to see it. And you know Benedict Cumberbatch is gonna deliver a killer performance for each of these Stranges, you guys. Zombie Strange probably is my most anticipated one, but I can't wait for Def Defender Strange. The one with the third eye, oh, this shit looks so awesome. Man, if you guys haven't seen the, the animated series, What If, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, it is MCU canon. I know some people don't like animation. That's fine, but you need to watch that in order to kind of get a grasp on what's potentially gonna happen. And I love What If, What If is so good. I mean, What If brought Marvel Zombies and now it looks like we're getting somewhat like a Marvel Zombie. Yo, you guys, this shit looks so good. I cannot wait, come next month. Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, you guys, is going to be a real game changer on every single level. Yeah. And I'm really curious to see where the film is going to end when it's all said and done. Like, where do you go? Like, what, what's the next big event? Obviously, I feel like multiverse, the multiverse is a yeah. huge event within itself. You know, you, you talk about the Infinity Saga, that's a big event. But the multiverse, I feel like, is catastrophic. It's huge. Where do you go after that? 
obviously you go into the next big Avengers movie. Kang the Conqueror, that's a possibility. Jonathan Majors, oh, cannot wait to see his performance in Ant-Man and the Wasp Quantumania, you guys, which releases next year. Hopefully we get a trailer by the end of this year. But push your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about this brand new TV spot for Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, you guys. And have you guys snagged your tickets? If not, you better get on it. This is a movie you don't want spoiled for you. Peace.